Okay, step seven, I took the rice that was done, and then I put it in the tray here, and I've got my aluminum foil. I'm going to put it over and wait for it to cool, and when it cools, I put it in the refrigerator downstairs, okay? Now, just to show you the size, I have all my carrots, my celery, and my parsley, and my leek in there, and all the chicken, of course, is taken out. I'm going to show you the size that I cut the, uh, the carrot, okay, and the celery. The celery, now, I have pretty big hands, but this is approximately, I'm going to say, um, gosh, uh, what is it, like a half an inch by half an inch kind of, sort of? And here's the, the slice of the carrot, so you can kind of tell comparatively, all right? That's how I do it, do a di diagonal slice. I clean, slice, I, I, I clean, I peel, and I slice. Okay, and what's the other thing I wanted to show you? Oh, I'm going to show you my cheater that I do, my cheater for vegetables, okay? This will go with the pork, uh, because everything else has vegetables in it. So I take a bag of this, a bag of that, half a bag of these mushrooms, again, Trader Joe's, yeah, yeah, okay. And I have the pearl onions, and I only do like eight pearl onions, I kid you not, in, and here's the size of my hand, you have an idea, in a casserole dish, I'm gonna turn it sideways so you have a clue. See my hand, see the size of the casserole dish, I'll show you the bottom so you have a clue, what it looks like. And this is my pesto pasta, chicken pesto pasta okay in here and I'm gonna cover this conglomeration so I do like mm, about a cup and a half of, of the mushrooms here okay I do almost an entire package of this or pretty much and a whole package of this, and I layer it and I do like eight maybe sometimes ten of these onions they're frozen everything's frozen so you, it keeps for a long time and then I'll cut up four tablespoons of organic butter and I add a half a cup of water, and if you want to get fancy, you can put a little white wine in, but I don't do that. I like to put white wine in chicken. And then I just put it together, layer it in here, put it in my refrigerator, and when we're ready to cook it two days later with the pork, or not cook it, put it in the oven. Um, again, when you're warming things up, the pork will take like, the pork and the pesto pasta will take, if you put it at 350 uh, convection, it's about 40, 45 minutes approximately, 40 to 45 minutes on convection at 350. This, it's like 25 minutes at the same rate. And there you go, and it, keep it covered. Uh, so that's step seven, and I'll, I'll show you, I'll probably have nine steps on this, and that's it. Thanks.